The idea of creating the most environmentally friendly supercar, it seems, more and more fill the minds of scientists and engineers in the automotive industry. The boom of hybrids and electric cars of our time is already hinting that the future has come. Is it possible to make a car capable of operating for 100 years, practically without refueling? and even running on environmentally friendly fuel. This question was asked by American inventor Lawrence Coulissis. In 2009, at the Chicago Auto Show, Lawrence Coulissis boldly put forward the idea of using nuclear fuel instead of ordinary fuel. The inventor proposed the use of an almost non-waste nuclear fuel based on a heavy weekly radioactive metal thorium, thorium, CH. Connecticut's inventor Charles Stevens and Connecticut's Laser Power Systems LPS, engineers picked up the idea, developed the concept of a nuclear engine, and successfully implemented it for this machine. The new Cadillac concept car is called World Thorium Fuel or Cadillac WTF. The concept of the Cadillac WTF exists so far only in the form of a computer model. It is only known that only 8 grams of thorium is enough for the owner of such a car for his whole life. This volume is enough for Hummer to go through 1,554,970 km without any harmful emissions whatsoever. Scientists estimate that 1 gram of this element is equivalent to 28,000 liters of gasoline. During a nuclear reaction, energy is released in excess, it will be enough to recharge the battery of this car, and other devices. Thorium has a fantastic density and is capable of generating just fantastic amounts of heat. According to expert Robert Hargraves, if scientists succeed in this experiment, then fundamentally new car engines will be very convenient and economical, and fuel will become much cheaper and will not be subject to constant inflation, and most importantly, that the fuel will be environmentally friendly product and humanity will save our planet. A small piece of thorium can create a laser beam that heats the water, generates steam and rotates the mini turbine that will be installed in the machine. According to Charles Stevens, president of OLPS, the experimental thorium-based engine is compact, weighs just 225 kilograms, and fits easily under the hood of any car. The car will age earlier than the engine and there will be no oil products or exhaust gases, nothing, says Stevens. The creators of this amazing concept car are planning to use heavy, duty and durable materials. The main components of the machine will be equipped with a safety feature in case of unexpected breakdowns. This will allow the owner of the WTF Cadillac not to repair the machine for 100 years, even with its daily operation. Futuristic design in the style of perhaps Salvador Dali is unusual in comparison with other machines. This Cadillac has 24 wheels, six on each side. This will always allow you to get home if one of the wheels is damaged. Each wheel is very narrow, equipped with a built-in induction electric motor. You don't have to change them. Only adjust and adjust them once every five years. It is planned that the Cadillac WTF will have a flexible design. This greatly simplifies management, like the muscles of a person. This machine will be able to change the angle of the wheels depending on the condition of the road surface and automatically adapt to it. The car's nuclear reactor is located at the rear of the car. According to the developers, for safety reasons, how the car will behave in an accident, and how crash tests will be conducted in general, is very, very interesting to know. But the project developers are still silent about this. It is also not yet known how to enter and exit the car.
In general, the Cadillac WTF on nuclear fuel completely changes the idea of cars, low environmental damage, and incredibly long life compared to current cars. Saving on repairs and fuel, is this possible? Our future is interesting because everything is possible in it. Thanks for watching this video.